Something to say, blew everybody away Wear whatever I want Dressed in a gown, everybody's like Why are you going nowhere special? Just going to the store I think I'd have it all, tell you why I'd be more Picking a plate, being a plate She is unruly Never seen her like this Didn't think it existed, no truly Don't get in the way, she's not in a place She'll get moved Take this girl for being me Cause these are dream rules This is someone else I'm not myself, no, no mm -hmm. Cause these are dream rules This is someone else I'm not myself, no, no Problems disappear She could tell you the things you wanna hear She could read your mind And that she could be alive Of a little lie So tell yourself it Die Never get it wrong It's always right Making the plate Being the plate She is on a rule Never seen it like this Didn't think it existed No truth She's not here to play, she'll get moody But don't mistake this girl for being me Cause these are dream rules This is someone else, I'm not myself, no, no mm -hmm. Cause these are dream rules the ninth okay this is ridiculous um the speed limit is 45 i'm going a cool 27 um uh, anyway i am headed to an eye appointment and um y'all excuse my windshield wipers them jokers is loud i need to be getting my nails done but i'm gonna make an appointment to get my nails done probably this coming week maybe Wednesday or Thursday of this week. I also need to get these eyebrows done because mm -mm, I don't like the way they're coming down right here. I have thin eyebrows, but I still like them to have some shape. So I need to make an eye appointment. I mean, eyebrow appointment and a nail appointment. That'll that'll be like a little self care type day. But anywho, today is Saturday. I'm going to the eye doctor, and then I'm taking my husband. Do y'all see that sign? <laughs> I just realized the sign. Somebody done hit the dog on sad. Um, taking my husband on a date. We're going for lunch. Um, I told him to choose a place, but he got his ride. <laughs> but he's um 
chosen a restaurant that is in the Phoebus area and I think it's a steakhouse. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited because neither of us have been and we like to try different restaurants. Um, is my nose dirty? See, I, squall! Um, anyway, it's gonna be a rainy day and when I came out, he was like, you know it's gonna rain today, right? I'm like, yeah, he's like, you got them all white. I know. I, I don't know. I'm not one of them people that the weather is going to dictate the colors I wear. The season does not dictate the colors I wear. The only thing, the only thing, what? The only thing that dictates what I wear is the temperature. It's going to be like, I think they're saying about a high of 61, 62 today and just rain. I mean, I got on a sweatsuit, so I will be comfortable in whatever temperature it is chooses to be outside and I'll be inside most of the day anyway um I don't know I I just like what I like like most of us but um he's like you look nice but it's gonna be rainy I know babe thanks though <laughs> I appreciate you <laughs> so anyway um headed to this appointment and uh god god and I forgot my tripod uh, oh well I'll talk to y'all a little bit later on. Here I find myself again. Time traveling only in my head. From the past to few. Well, the rain is really coming down now. Um, <clears throat> y'all, I'm so glad that I went and had those um had my eyes checked again. So I told you the red frames that I had. Um, I'll try to remember to put a little clip up here somewhere on the screen. I was so excited when I got those glasses, if y'all can remember, because I loved the frame. Just something totally different than what I'm used to wearing. Um, the prescription in them, I told y'all I felt like Fred Sanford. <clears throat> and I didn't tell y'all. I was like, why do I feel like Fred Sanford with these glasses on, honey? So, at the time, my doctor had me on this crazy um, prescription uh, for high blood pressure. Now, mind you, my blood pressure is not high at all. So they had me on, okay, I don't know what this person is doing. They had me on um, Lasardin. And that prescription was supposedly like a low grade or low dosage or however you want to term it. And I noticed that I would get headaches when I take it. Um, I would get nauseous. And I know all medications have some type of side effects. So when I went to the eye doctor, it was just five months ago. The, when I went to the eye doctor, my prescription had changed drastically. And I'm like, how? Because I could still see through my other glasses. So I started thinking back and I was like, that's when that prescription for Lasardin changed and it was low dose but I don't need it because I only have elevated blood pressure numbers when I'm at the doctor's office I take my blood pressure at home and it's fine um so when I was telling my eye doctor just now you know what was going on during that time and he was like so how was work and I was like I mean it's fine it's not super super it wasn't super super stressful at the time I would have moments of stress but nothing that was like long-standing and so he said you know no matter how low your low your dosage was it could affect your vision that blood any any medication really so now I have basically weaned myself to a lower like not taking it every single day I don't have the headaches as much I noticed that my vision is like clearer and so this is a this is a cautionary tale just because the doctor tells you that there's a medication that you have to take if you're feeling weird check on it because I just had my eyes checked and my vision when he looked at five months ago to today he's just like this is bananas so my prescription is basically um a whole lot better and he's like your distance is fine you're you have 20 20 distance and which i already knew because i don't need like i'm sitting in the car right now i'm looking at the menu 
on the Starbucks screen and I can see the I can see the menu from my car. But it's the computer, the laptop, the iPad, any of my electronics. Um, it's a whole vision thing. So my glasses are basically like reading glasses for technology. So um super excited. They're gonna fix my glasses that broke last week and they're just gonna change out my lenses of my red frames. And so I'll have my glasses back. I'm gonna run in here and get me a lavender matcha and I will tweak tweak talk what? Alright, so let's do a quick <laughs> haul. This is what I got. Y'all, I stopped at Marshall's. Mm-hmm. I did. Take a little sip of my coffee. This is really good. I know, I know, the boycotting of Starbucks. I like my coffee. So, uh, yeah, I did. I stopped at Marshall's because I wanted, I needed a night serum. And um, let's see what I ended up getting along with my night serum. I hope this cinematic view looks okay. I gotta show y'all my outfit of the day too. Um, this is my handbag that I'm carrying today. It's just a green purse, it's like a tote actually. Got it from Amazon. I'll link it in the description below. Um, this is just a white sweatsuit. This is one of the, my Timu sweatsuits. I don't know if you can see me. I'm very far, but I like it. It's nice and baggy. Um, I'll set up the camera in the living room to show you the full fit, or I'll probably just take a picture and post it. Um, and I'm just wearing my Jordans with it. Um, so yeah, and all my jewelry, well, my earrings and my bracelets are Sassy Jones, Apple Watch, wedding rings. All these rings here came from, um, oh, I saw the difference with the cinematic. It's very blurry. Hmm. And I see this box moving across the screen, but my rings are, um, from Shein. Now let's get to this quick Marshall's haul before we go to lunch. All right. So. I spent a whopping $58.02, and that's with my discount. I saved $6.14 because thanks to my daughter, because she's an employee there. So I get a discount at Marshalls, Home Goods, TJ Maxx. Um, so yeah. All right, I got a pink rose and almond milk body scrub. Okay, I don't think I like this cinematic. Cause it's very blurry. Let me change it to just regular video. Okay, so like I was saying, this is a pink rose and oat milk body scrub repair and hydrate. This is, oh my God, take the sticker off cause I don't like stickers on the top of my stuff. Almond milk and Manuka honey body butter. You can see it on the side there. And the brand is Soroa. I've never heard of this brand, but I'm pretty pretty sure it's a good brand. This actually was on clearance, um, $4.50, and normally $5.99. This was $6.99, that wasn't on clearance yet. <clears throat> what else did I get? We got some lavender facial mist. We got some hand soap for the bathroom, eucalyptus mint. I got it because it's um, unisex, so that both of us can use it on, put it in our bathroom, in our bedroom. Um, no, no. Uh, I got another facial cleansing brush. This one is gonna sit on the bathroom sink. The other one hangs in the shower. Uh, a back stretching like cloth, like a, what do you call this thing? It's a, you can take the top off. It's a, what is this thing? Like a loofah, but it stretches and you can, you know, wash your back. Um, this was on, this was $3.99. The facial mist, it's a toner, was is $5.99. This brush was $5.99. I needed a new towel for my hair when I wash my hair on, on clearance for $4. Pretty green and white. Y'all know I love my green. My favorite honey syrup. Look, I be eating these like lollipops instead of just using them in my tea. Cause they're good. Oh, by the way, Marshall now has um, Manuka honey and vanilla bean paste. They have several different brands. This is the cheapest one. This one was $7.99, but you don't have to use a lot of vanilla bean paste. Um, the most expensive one was like 15, still in the store. Then 
my last couple of items that I got. Put this back. Oh, and this mist comes in, whoops. It comes in rose water, cucumber, unscented. And I think there was one more, but I wanted the lavender. And, oh, this is my night serum because I've been looking for a night serum. And this one is an oil, overnight repair, retinol, and blue tansy. Have no idea what blue tansy is, but we about to see how it does with my skin. And this is uh, $5.99, but I like it because it was something for overnight. And it's not like a gel. I want it like more of an oil base, and that's what this is. And then the last thing, y'all know I can't go to Marshall without getting a candle. So, I got a candle. And I'm loving these containers that they're coming in. The other one at the front came in a container just like it. It is... This one was on clearance for $6. And I don't even know what the fragrance is because it covered it's covering up the fragrance let me see if i can get this figure off i just know i like the way it smells because i smelled something spicy vanilla and patchouli and it is leobin y'all know leobin and dw home are my favorite candles because they have a really good throw but isn't that pretty green oops Did I stick the candle in? lord i got the top in the candle lord all right so that is my Marshall's haul. Oh, and it broke. Shoot, glass. Where did a piece of glass go? I gotta go back to Marshall's because I just spilled the oil all over the count the counter. I'll be back. Take it away, take it away. Feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough Too caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let me Something in my brain wants you I've been hanging by myself Asking for help to work on you Yeah, you You always make me feel like Oh yeah, you You never leave my thoughts alone Yeah, you You're the reason I'm going out of my mind I just can't stop thinking about you So we are now in Dillard's and I'm seeing so many pieces that I like and I don't know. I'm trying not to buy nothing today, but oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at that. It's a full dress. It could be used as a nice cover up because it's see through. It's just, it's knitted and it has tassels on the bottom so beautiful all right i am now in ulta i need some more eye masks and i need a night serum because y'all saw that i just broke the one that i had all right back home this was a long day it was good it was fun it was fulfilling um so last stop was ulta so remember i got the mini set of the hydration kit y'all remember i had the little baby one this is almost gone, so I got a full size one. And I'll be using this at night to replace the one that I just broke. Also picked up a pretty cheek color. It's a blush stick. Where where's your glasses? It's an Ulta product. Oh, oh, I love that, okay. So it's double capped and Oh, wait, okay. And that's the color. 
It's a cream and it is for lips and cheeks. So I cannot wait to try this out. I started to get a new Laura Mercier pow um, liquid foundation. It was actually a cream um, tinted moisturizer. I got another setting spray because I'm almost out of the one that I have. How much more of a mess are you gonna make today, girl? I got some um, Good Molecules eye patches. It's the box. And I'm probably gonna keep them in the fridge because eye patches, I need to get one of those little mini refrigerators that you sit on your bathroom counter or under your counter because there's some things that I want to keep. Oh yeah, it's very, has a good slip. Unscented, but very gelatinous. Um, I'm definitely gonna put these in the refrigerator. Like not keep it in there, but when I'm ready to use it. It's caffeine energizing hydrogel eye patches. And is this all I got? Yeah, and then I got a miniature bake set by Morphe. I wanted to try it out. There's a box that it comes in. Um, so I wanted to, I don't have, have this one. And so it's just a powder for bake. Uh, did I say bake set? I meant bake and set. So i um, gonna use this. I have one that is by Mary Kay, but it's huge. And it's kind of hard to pack when I just want like small things. Let me see if I can find it. This is my translucent powder from Mary Kay. And I keep forgetting I have these. I need to take these out so that I can put them where I can see them. I need a whole new setup. That's gonna be a project. I'm gonna start looking for a new setup for my skincare and my makeup. I'm done for today. I'm about to wash my face, take all my makeup off, go downstairs pour myself a glass of wine and sit down, relax and watch TV. And y'all remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. I hope you've enjoyed hanging with me today and I will talk to you later. Peace, love and blessings to each and every one of you. Good night.